he's lurking just yet and that lurk about to be spotted out at seven taking down the sheriff on top of the head hunter proven to be the better gun in that trade as steel goes up on top of the wall and weed is ready for it the wall cut down and he won getting cut down here on their attack as curry goes aggressive he had something to say about it for just a second if you blink you missed it three kills went the way of the reina but one gets stolen back for game and dwight phone needs to clutch it out and he does just that yeah, that they will. I, I love when teams do go for this up top play. There's so many opportunities, especially with that Ares in hand. And oh. well, that's exactly what the gun does. Seven goes for the skill shot with the pistol. It won't work out for him as much as we did. Top position here. He'll be revealed. And well, the Ares should soon find the end of this round. Is Curry instead? we the one to sit side. It's planted out for mid. That's exactly where Pony. Lies and wait around the corner comes JC Stun and he's just not ready for the angle. The Ares comes out on top of the Phantom. It's a weapon to be retrieved and upgrade to be had should he need it. But speaking of Vipers, we did. Able to find one across the map. Oh, Curry, he has so much information. His ears, they're prickling. It's critical. It's just on the other side. Seven will help out as well. He's now weeded in a tough position. He's already fought off for one. And he's on the high ground, but Curry cuts him straight out of the sky. And with the dismiss, finds exactly where weeded hides. There's Molly's falling on the spike. And there's bodies dropping, too. It's this is where T1 is headed, and that's right there is a true giveaway. Oh, seven. What a great positioning to find the shot on to Thief. He was just trying... To deny the plant, but in doing so, he loses his life. Now, his retake's gonna be tough. Already the walking wounded on the side of KCP. The Let's have some credits. They can oh, look to go on the hunt, and there it is. The A site wanting to strip these weapons away. Should he do so, might put KCP. Okay, they're just gonna push forward, try and get that spike down. Rifle probably gets caught in that and will be detained. Eventually will fall, but it's one for one overall. And Meanwhile, the backstab around the corner. We just saw that kill come the way of Curry. They have to pay attention to that. Fortunately, Thief is a little bit later on the push. As J-Mo just holding the stick. The operator not going to find the shot. J-Mo is going to hang on to it. Still trying to claw their way. 45 seconds left on the clock. They're looking to make this hit. As Hunter Shuri looks to deny. Viper's picking to be used to get onto the site in seven. The first to fall in these rounds once more. He utility. Tossed out to try and slow the attack down as we did. Picks one up out towards mid. It's steel. Off the board to no lurk for you. Says KCP. As that spike will finally get planted, but it's a player deficit. Sure, they have the pit to work with, but Pony has to go perfect. Almost turns his back and misses the timing as the op swap doesn't come through in time. And JMO meets that same fate. Now we did. The Viper player for KCP. Can he thrive inside the opposing pit? He finds nothing, unfortunately. It's a bounce shot dart, so he knows if there's actually something there. He knew the info it broke because that silver voice line, but Seven! Oh my he knows God. the angle to hit with the operator. Another man here tries to get shot down. Seven, just hitting every shot here. He said it was his warm up. He's looking pretty damn warm to me, Tanner. <laughs> yeah, that he is. Picks up three quick remaining. kills. This pony will find the fourth. We did the last one standing. And you talked about the economy. This is a, a scary place to be. He's able to find Curry. Takes down the Reyna, but he's going to be taken down. It's been bought in a little bit here for KCP on their lesser buy. And they're trying to do the same push. And yet again, it's getting dismantled. Thief will grab one and get away, but he's already wounded. And Curry finishes the job. Stani, though, he's so good at that. There he's with seven. Better with the operator, the flick across the shot to connect. And now, in a three versus two, it's the left. Just to two on this retake. The spam boy good, not enough. Seven again with the operator shut things down. T1. Viper's wall, the toxic screen. What if fourth doesn't land? Curry, he's crept all the way up. The sneaky beaver himself will take down Weeded as the hunter. Shuri doesn't find too much. That one used, it clears out the site. The shock start finds some damage in the lockdown. Actually used white bow has always managed to get that spike planted. He's been doing his job so incredibly well. Now the rest of the squad needs to do theirs. The seven inside the lockdown stands firm for a kill. Teleports away with the rendezvous and well, nobody detained here in this. The last round of the half, it's KCP fighting for the best they can get. A player down as the knives continue to go aggressive. Gamo cut down as well. Pony hops his way to the feed. And now critical, a tall task round after round for this KCP squad. And they just cannot live up to it. Viper utility going to be exchanged to try and slow things down. And okay, well, Viper also can hop to the kill feed. So you kill, classic shot, headshots landing. It's deep. On the opposite side of the toxic screen, really doing damage to dismiss to try and add some paranoia to it. Tries to thrive in the chaos. Unfortunately, Curry gonna come out on top, and the spike is planted. 
So it's T1 working against the clock and the nano swarms that delay for just a moment. No. But the bodies are starting to fall. No way. JC Stani stays alive. You put a pistol in this guy's hand and he will do things unthinkable as he swings around the right clicks good curry truck can make this a site take very much easier you should run as we see the the weirdo lineups curry not quick enough on the dismiss to get away unfortunately jc sonny there to trade him back and we see the vandal come out on top of the aries one of the first duels that we've seen between those two weapons today is seven just on the outside of the lockdown t1 do Give up the site for now. Shock darts go out. Completely misweeded. He's very healthy. Maybe you're expecting one to be low HP in this 4v4 retake. Take it a 4v3. Steel hops his way to the kill feed. Pony's going to get one back. So we go one for one on the site. But KCP, they're just getting mowed down. Seven. Able to take down critical as this wall falls. Pony's going to be on the other side. J Mo. A lot of utility early in. Seven. He doesn't need the operator. To find the early pick. He decapitates JC Stani, teleports away to safety. As the four remaining are stacked up, death balled, looking to take this ace type. He won just about all here at the very least. The odds are even in the 4v4 is steal. A nice reveal Fight onto deep will take down the Reyna. The Titan one Planner once one more. And sure, there's extra credits, but you don't have extra HP. We did falls. Three stand tall for T1. And to catapult us into a second of find is you see a buy going out for kcp but that's the best word i would use to describe it because it is scrappy to say the least lesser weapons light armor across the board his life is a result that would have been so unfortunate if a glitch lost them this round but still no one's out of the woods yet because kcp they swung it straight on in beat that could be a mistake if pony fell and twifo trades back it was a huge advantage for the side of KCP, now squandered to steal. To do his best bit of aggression up top. The we'll fall away off the drone, the dive no into way. the pit. How is this happening, Pony? Just holds remaining. close, swings forward, grabs Side one, down. and his only critical remaining, the final man, but he's got a no-scope. Gun recovered, and his final opponent far away. Like to be planted, and... Right now, information on his side, dark to come through, the time is so far gone, walls up, will it come down, no, Wifo sticking, he's just holding critical, no. has called the bluff, but a bluff. Unfortunately, we don't get that attacking style just yet, and Steel, he strays away from the pack, he's forced to use that trailblazer to try and clear this one out, Sweden almost sneaks away from it all, it's not the util that spots him at 7 instead. And it is, Stani. Let's hop down here and get this pike planted. Critical. They have no idea. Three players. No, 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 no. no. He gets nothing. Critical. That is abominable. He needed to find way more than that, frankly. Way more than zero, but he doesn't. It's in the wash. Next set of frags. That's where we have to go. And Wipo, he's the focus. Maybe a little overzealous here, but the nade will zone timing. That's a big issue. And it's me. continuing to tick on down. Stani has the pull to buy more for T1. And, well... The numbers, those are dwindling. Curry has fallen. Three feet one to take care of seven, but seven's right clicks, they work better. Look at the HP though. There's no chance. The timer is done. The crossfire established in the final blow. It comes from Stani. There are flexible options and it seems like it is just going to be the sky. Clearing through showers is an A site split is the destination of KCP, but that new sort of box means a new angle for Seven. And no, it doesn't really matter the angle, because Seven will find the shots regardless. Takes two down without even taking a whiff of reply. Now Stani fights back with vengeance, but one, it's one frag. Remaining. And in the round as a whole, it's all but meaningless. One man with a mission, it's we did, but uh, something tells me we did not win this round for the side of KCP. That was KCP's bonus. They get to slow things down. They get to full buy. And round to seven. Oh okay. my goodness. JC Stani ready for it. The face shells. I thought they went wide, but he's still good for one. Critical. The A side. Fortunately, we're on bind. That means there's another teleporter to be had. And Dwipo has some kills right in front of him as he expects one more. He pulls out the shorty. It's weeded in the clutch again. Seats with some sheriff's work. Wipo. Oh, that timing is abysmal. Well, actually, he gets nothing out of it as the TTs come through. Beast is under so much pressure here that he's not able to stand up against but the Viper's pit has come down on the site. Still, dog, that's going to be able to clear through. It goes long instead. So this Viper, still unknown. The fight on critical is crucial because he's the gatekeeper of the cross in towards his pit and Stani holds on the other side. It's a crossfire across. But for how long? Inside the pit. 
Light's muted, now it's swapped instead, but... Hold. Steel is just holding. He's sticking this one all the way to half. They have no idea where this is, and no, no one is way. stopping Steel! How has he done this? The pit was not on the spike! Also of saying still and steel and steel and... Seven. Making it difficult. Fortunately, yeah, we get to mix it up. We can say seven as he takes down Weeded with the operator. Same fight. angle, goes back for more, bites off more than he can too, but Curry here to get it back. And Pony on the cross. The shower's control has been beautiful from T1. In factor, did that see him? I think it's fun around and should have spotted him out, but Curry, despite the knowledge, no longer has a head to think with. This critical looks to get this done, but. So on the other side is Seal, and his timer's ticked I so far down. He's forced to commit to the plant here. Actually, teleporting is an option. If he kills Seal, he can get out, but the Molly is so good at zoning. And Seal now coming on through. It's going to go wide. Does it land? No, it doesn't. It's only a tag, so it's damage onto one. And Seal pushes through the Nebula Smoke, but he's answered right back immediately. And this is that tag member in Thwipo. Not the safest to push on through the regrowth. To help top him off, it's critical playing the close angle with the Aries and Dwyfo Curry work hand in hand to get it done. The dynamic duo now looking for Morris. Dwyfo pushes out. JC Stani falls, and Thief now needs to try and find a way to steal the round here in a one v four. Thief uh -oh. not even gonna. There's an actual smoke there in the face of the opposition. That is such a perfect dart from Steel. He swings off, knows he's pressured on the site, so has to take control elsewhere, and that's exactly what he does, Curry! Oh my god. On the site, does even better, that's three for The thrifty equipment into them. Oh, seven. Every single time, it seems to be a different angle, but it's not on top of the truck, it's inside showers. Now looking to do it with oh the my showstopper, god. he picks up two. J-Mo standing too close to JC Sonny. Oh. There's the fourth on the round, and make sure nobody can push him from the defender's sided spawn, but is he ready? The backstab around the corner, and there it is, the ace for seven. Seven. Don't look for more, surely not. Does miss the shot. It's just a leg. To where you have to try and just pick one, because seven is holding the other with the operator. The ace site has been so locked down, and... You see it here in this round. Curry stands tall for another right click on the classic. Won't land, but JC Sonny not going to be standing for long. Nice wall bang. There is seven with the operator grab. Mimi, I don't know. This round is about to it's be an interesting one. Duplicating. He's like soon to be compromised. Sonny already out in JMO. Eat that stand. That's so risky. Oh, Why take that? You have managed. Get the Nova Pulse. Not gonna find too much with the paint shells. The seven goes up top. Maybe it's being okay. spotted. Yes, they do. Thief now trying to push aggressively. As Curry will find the frag onto the viper. The pit comes down. But the body's starting to drop. And T1 closes no out just like that. But they don't have the time. No Curry. It was all but to clear things out. Flash out towards backside. There's the paint shells. Ow. Used and Curry able to come out on top of Thief. But we did there to trade it in body shot. Gonna be enough to find the kill left. onto the Astra. But for the time being. We did place on the inside, the dash, unfortunately, just not going to be quick enough for KCP. They start to steal him right back. The health bars are low, but it might not matter There's if they alert. continue to find the kills. And Wipo outside the smoke. JC Sonny ready for it some way, somehow. Not feel good, and everybody vulnerable here inside the U-Haul as they try to storm on through. This is where the judge will thrive. The Ares as well, wallbang kill on to steal, and now Pony. You can slow it down, T1. They're going to wait that out, and... Right the poison cloud, not gonna find too much, but the bulldog it bites for one. Curry falls, Pony's there to trade it back. Now, assuming this position inside pocket, it's a scary one. That wall or that box, excuse me, right next to you, it's wall bangable, so you don't want to stand there for too long. As flashes come through. We see a little bit of that wall bang happening in Jay backside and just started winning fights, right? That's basically a 50 50 round, and we're seeing the same KCP. It pushes T1 back. Now, you're in a situation where, sure, you bought a lot of utility, and the Hunter Fury grabbed you a kill. If you have a lot of time on the clock, you can look to make plays, but no space garnered here. So they have to go Watch right back to it. it and you see what KCP have in the back pocket. His cosmic divide also used critical, almost undetected. Seven going to take him down. And the 50-50, the duels, they're starting to go the way of T1, but only for a second. We continue the back and forth. The health bar's low on Curry, but it doesn't matter. Pony's there to bail him out. They got to get the spike planted. They have plenty of time to do so now. The hunt you have to be assuming that somebody's inside showers but what's the short looking like spots out the race takes him down now a 1v2 if you can find that sky looking doable here in the 1v1 Hurry's rapping we did, though i've got yes, your trail. the low hp we did ready for this seekers used position revealed and 
Now a reload. Unfortunately, Weedit's got the right idea. He's reading the play perfectly. He's just running out of time to do something about it. Flash goes out. Nova Pulse. The time game is so perfect here for T1. He eventually finds that low HP Sky, but it's all for naught. Should be here on the trade. I thought Seven was going to go for the jump peak, but he doesn't instead. This is not the call whatsoever. They're considering the rotation. The Zani falls off his line. Now he has to re peek in, but it's not an issue. Travel okay. helps out for Steel. Runs out of options. And looks just to hold on Wingle. He's ready for this. Spot the head of steel. And fortunately, Seven's there to trade it back. The pistols get one and damage the name of the game. Come out of this timeout. Unfortunately, that weapon just too far out of reach. And here comes the showstopper. The one kill is the go button. And Seven will find the Welcome next. And with that weapon, Swipe was able to trade the kill back once more. Healing the player everything. advantage in favor of T1. The positioning advantage in favor of T1. As they've got the Viper's pit, but it's only for a second. JC Stani, he goes huge. Now in the 2v2, the pit has fallen. The spike planted. JMO gonna find a huge off shot onto Curry. Looks to go big with the shorty up close and personal. Astro v Astro. Pony goes close. Would be rough. The glass cannon operator of JMO. Oh my god. Curry knocks them both down and it's Casey. It's Gravwell. Pulls forward, shows nothing, but look at the timer. 10 seconds left, and Stani is still on the site. He's not revealed. Left. He can just ride around. He can just play this time with the plant is committed. He can end it. He can take care of Steel. Needs to find a spam. He misses the shots. The plant comes through, but it's still a two. It's planted. It's a bit of an issue. Because defenders not even spawn control that can loss. They know it. They hear the footsteps up towards heaven. But that's small. It can aid the right click. No. Unlucky. The numbers generate against him. It's Dwifo. Molly forward tries to spray the shorty. Not picked up in time. And Critical's just holding this pony. He's unaware. He's not ready. The time is so low. But the Molly. The Molly ends it. Dwifo from the grave. The pony's there. He ends the round. Pony has clutched it. With died to win things out. Martyrdom guess themselves they come right on back that's the right call the seekers go through blast pack over the top and the bodies they fall the b site it's been opened up all three defenders across the map are now trying to rotate over ecp three left they have utility they love to go quickly here off of that dark but t1 has already fallen back they have a strong post plant but we did he's even out the odds He'll able to get one back. Unfortunately, the Viper can't one do it all for remaining. this squad. And the last one standing is JC Stani. Okay. He's been clutch. He did it a handful of times on Icebox. Needs to do it again here on Split. But he swings and it's...